All right, hey guys, how's it going? So uh, today, nothing special. Just gonna play, uh, gonna play a rank match with uh, my spell swords deck, spell sword tokens deck. <laughs> uh, not my deck. I didn't create this deck. This is something I I got off of. Uh, I think it was that legenddeck.com. I can't remember who the author was. Whatever. Um, but we have some quests today uh, for Spell Sword, and you can see I already won one game, so hopefully we could, we could win another. <laughs> so, uh, so just some legends, uh, some some uh, legend rank play for you today. I'm currently 656. And you can see right here, which you know for me uh, was in the area of 800 to 1200. Uh, seems to be my normal my normal rank, and I'm not ashamed of that. Uh, this is you know I mean just just for me to hit legend is I think it's pretty good. Um, you know I played Hearthstone for a while and I never hit legend, but I never put a lot of time into that game really. It was just kind of a time killer. You know I never really sunk a lot of money or time or effort into it. In this game I'm really putting a lot more effort and time of course into it and money too so um but i'm okay with that but yeah i think my best actually was 237 that, i think that's pretty good anyways i'm gonna stop talking your guys' ear off and we're gonna jump into a ranked match here with the spell sword token deck and uh, you can see the deck list deck list on the left there uh and uh once again you guys I apologize about the camera shaking I am sitting in the recliner with my laptop so every movement I do the, <laughs> the laptop does you know, like every little I guess I could prop my chair up so it doesn't rock mm. smoothie today so Serac Serac the unvanquished See if we could vanquish him. He's running. Okay. So, wow, two divine fervors. If we can only keep those in our hand right now. Um, unfortunately, you know, I, I'm gonna keep one of them just because they're so essential to this deck. I mean, that's what buffs our creatures. I'm gonna get rid of the Bruma Profiteer just because we don't need it early. It is a two drop. But I'm going to gamble here and hopefully get 5th Legion Trainer and some small tokens. There's 5th Legion Trainer. Um, and we do have the Elixir, so gambling wasn't really that risky. So, um, I think keeping Divine Fervor might have been a little too greedy, but hey. At least, uh, at least we got, at least we got that chick right there. We could drop Kvatch Soldier next turn and buff him up to a 3-3. Three, three. And uh, contest whatever fall, he drops. Maybe not. Lately. So that's fine. Uh, we'll just go ahead and just. Uh, you know, I think dropping Kavat Soldier in the Shadow Lane, saving our Fifth Legion Trainer, is probably the best move because next turn we can drop Imperial Reinforcements. Or, you know. Black Mar Black Marsh Warden, if you want, want to be greedy, I think uh, I think that's the best move. You know, sacrificing this guard, and with him having three Magicka, he doesn't have any removal. Take that out. He could he could take it out with that with his Fighters Guild recruit and just tr drop another one, but then we'll still be able to benefit from our Imperial reinforcements, and that's what was really going to help us out. So. Yeah, I'm uh, so just a uh, scout ramp, I believe scout ramp. Uh, you guys, yeah, I'm not really good at deciphering decks that people are using. I watch people play all the time, and you know, they see a couple cards play, and they could identify right away what they're playing against. I have a harder time doing that. Um, so, but this looks like some sort of a ramp deck. So we should be okay against this because we'll be filling the board quickly um, but he will 
we'll be dropping out some big creatures. You can't defeat me. So piercing javelin is a must for us, which we do have. We're running three copies. This one offers something tasty. Okay. Whatever Seems we hear. Kind of like a kind of like a desperate move, I think, for him. So do we drop Black Marsh Warden? Because we're gonna lose this chick next turn. Or do we get real greedy, throw down Divine Fervor, buff everybody up? I think we drop Black Marsh so we can get some creatures on the board to benefit from our Divine Fervor next turn. Acknowledged. We'll go ahead. I and hear let's, and obey. let's break a ruin. You can't defeat but me. Into the that's breach. all we're gonna do. Is break one ruin. I hear and obey. Uh, we'll go ahead and drop Black Marsh. I do not fear that. Yeah, and the shitty thing is he's not going to lose his 2-2 lethal. But oh well. My Throw one of our tokens on it and take it out. There's one of the big creatures I was talking about. I think we're running Edict. There we go. Nice. So, that's... Pretty much a no-brainer. I mean, we have to get rid of that. As good as and we'll go ahead and break one more ruin. Into the breach. And that's it. That's all we're gonna do. Let's play it safe. So we're looking pretty good. That's okay, because next turn we can go 3, what 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15, 15, yeah, well, 15 damage. Hmm. So the question is, do we bring him down to 1 health? I think we do, because he's going to get something out of that uh, Moonlight Werebat. So I think we do this. Chaos. I hear and obey. Okay. Please, not another moonlight wear bat. Death comes to us all. That's fine. She's gonna do this, and we have another one, which we will, well, unfortunately won't be able to play this turn, but that's okay. So I, th I think the answer is still face. Into the because Acknowledged. we should have enough creatures on board next turn, even if he hits for that. Oh man, our luck, huh? Well, not really. Two out of five were prophecy. I guess that's not bad luck. That's completely fine. Can he actually buff that? Because it was a 2-2. Uh, two -two. <laughs> that's funny. They still be able to take it out, though. So we're just going to drop East March Crusader, no matter what. card draw value, and even if he drains for four, you have seven, can't take anything else out, we should be able to win this game. I'm trying to think of anything he could play at turn eight. I don't think he has anything that can save him. You must be Everything clean. he has is too slow. That's a good answer, but don't think it's gonna save him. He just might end up quitting, actually. So I'm eager to have a uh, another pack opening video coming because, as I said before, my last video, I recorded a whole, uh, a whole pack opening video, and lost all of it. So, yep, just as I thought. So that was a pretty good match for us. Um, and I'm gonna leave it at that, guys. I just wanted to record a quick video just to stay active. 
and get something out there. Um, I will be doing some more videos because I'm really enjoying this. Uh, I was thinking about actually doing an arena run for. Uh, I, I'm not. I am not good. God, dude, what do we gain? Like two ranks? Jeez, terrible. Um, I'm not great at arena, but. I could show you guys some mediocre arena runs, you know, so, uh, so that's it. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it and, um, have a good day. Thanks.